There's a lot of string on my bamboo that I get off the pig feed. This helps just to support it on the actual bamboo stick. Now, look at the size of these roots. These are heirloom seeds. You get a lot of you get a lot of good roots with them. You get a lot of good products off of it. So that's all done. Take that out. This, I still see some little flowers on here. So they might still continue to germinate. You never know. You might get some late ones. You see some flowers on there. The corn, totally shot. Our corn is just done for the season. This shit could just go down to the hogs. Just come in here and pull them out. The ground, either it was too dry or too moist or just too dry. I mean, the the winter, we didn't have a winter. It was just hot. You never, the, it, you work very hard to plant seeds. You don't get nothing back. I might be able to salvage some, but there's really nothing here to salvage. I might be able to get two or three corns, kernels off these things. But this is done. The garden's done for the summer. Our summer garden. We didn't get nothing really good back this year. From our corn. And it's just the temperatures too. The temperature makes a big thing about it. I might be out able to salvage some. But I'm not going to be able to salvage all. That's for sure. And I'm probably going to have to make two or three videos. Again, my phone, my recording device I use to make videos is acting up. This this area is basically overtaken. I'll leave something there. But I do see some green peppers I could pick today and bring in the house before they get demolished. And look, something demolished this one. That's crazy, y'all. I'm so sick of it. I'm so sick of these bugs is eating on my stuff. I'm gonna it's small. I don't want to pick it yet. But you can see teeth marks here. And let's see if we can move this sucker down a little bit. Yeah, somebody's been eating here. See? Good for the pickings. Pick it off because it's not gonna do nothing for you. All it's doing is wasting energy trying to feed plants that are not really going to be helping you that that's that's sad that's real sad to me that's real sad to me when animals do this come here and eat your fruit this is not good at all i don't like that ah uh, but that's what happens when you go garden you got garden and you live in the wild animals will come out here and destroy your crop I can't believe he pulled up my gourd plants. He says he didn't, but they're not there. They're missing. They're not just going to get up and run. You can't eat them. Three plants I planted here are gone. He claims he didn't take them. And these are the sweet potatoes. They're going to get pulled up today. I don't know how many are going to be up underneath the ground, but it needs to be pulled. The, the mint tree is taking over. These are sunflower stalks. That we're just letting it dry out. They still have their little bugs on it. Yeah, we're just letting these dry out. And um, once they get... Yeah, I don't want to put my hands on it. But you can see those little bugs. I'm going to make them famous today. Yeah, you don't like the camera? You're eating my shit up. Those are the bugs I believe that are eating stuff up. And I can't even salvage any seeds out of it. Because it's dried out. So, where does it go? Out there. With the wildlife. And I'll try to clean this up. Later and try to salvage me some seeds from it. Other than that, there's nothing else going on out here. I'm just waiting for Bonnie to drop these piglets. So we could go forward. Got a lot of things coming up. And I'm trying to get out of here probably about September. Yeah, probably about September. And try to get up out of here so I could go in make some fast cash and bring it back to my land and can continue going forward with my dreams and my vision board that I created and I want to go forward with my dreams and if you want to take the ride take it if not then salavi and have a nice day
But other than that, nothing else going on out here. Yeah, I got to get rid of it. They, they're leaking all over the place. They ain't even worth eating. I got some in the house I could eat. It's very, very, very sad when wildlife want to eat your 